Hey synth heads, today we're gonna to talk about how I acquired all of my gear. Hi, I'm Pure Ambient Drone, and this is my channel where I talk about synthesizers. I demo them, I review them, and I make electronic music. So if you haven't already done so, please hit that subscribe button and tap that bell to keep up with all of my synth adventures. Now let's get on with the video. So in 2005, I went through a divorce. And I'm here to tell you that some divorces really, really suck. And mine was one of them. I ended up not losing only everything materialistically. But I also had my brother die that same year. And my son was diagnosed with muscular dystrophy. And I'd like to cut straight to the point in my videos. I felt sorry for myself. I was depressed. I was discouraged. And I had given up hopes of anything that I had ever aspired for in my life after that divorce took place. And it wasn't just because I lost so much. It was because I had tried so hard and I had felt like an absolute failure. And it took me years and years and years to get up off my feeling sorry for myself but and fighting again and so I started looking online for synthesizers and on my local Cra Craigslist here I found a broken Roland D50 it was the only real synthesizer that was for sale online the guy wanted $50 for it I met up with him in a public parking lot I say that because you guys want to be safe when you're dealing with uh, buying stuff locally or, or anywhere on Craigslist or any or any kind of uh, you know money exchange with strangers and I, I started telling the guy you know I used to have a studio and my wife ran off with some Chippendale dancer and I lost everything he gave me the synthesizer for twenty dollars I guess he felt sorry for me too I didn't tell him all of that to make him feel sorry for myself. We were just talking. I actually did try to give him the, the, the 50 bucks. He wouldn't take it. I got it for 20. Right afterwards, I was offered $500 for the synthesizer. $500 for a broken Roland D50. All it would do was turn on. Nothing else would work, okay? No sound. The buttons wouldn't work right. I mean, it was really kaput. I take that $500 and I start reinvesting in other gear to resell. Now let me clarify something. I often say on my channel here, do not sell gear to buy gear. And that's what I was doing, but not in the sense how I mean it today. See, I was buying broken gear, I was buying damaged gear, and I was buying gear that I didn't personally care about because I knew that there was a value in it for other people. You see, people will get rid of lesser wanted gear a lot quicker than they will classics. So that gear goes very cheaply. So I was looking for that kind of gear. So here's some hints and tips for you. Look for the stuff that people really don't want and you can get it at a better price if you know how to negotiate. I had a business background going for me. I used to own several businesses in the 90s. So I had a little bit of negotiating skills. Anyhow, I would take that money and reinvest it. And every now and then, I would have a few extra dollars left over. And I could get myself something that I did want to keep. Have I ever sold gear that I liked and uh, used it to buy other gear? I've made that mistake and that's why I tell people not to do that. Keep everything you possibly can. I know it sounds impossible, I know it sounds hard, but if you think hard enough, if you work hard enough, no matter what your circumstances, you can make your dream happen. Don't let anyone or any excuse tell you that you can't have your dream. You can pursue your dream. You can do what you want to do. Now, before I get flooded with a lot of comments, you know, with people in, in their lifestyles, I understand that there's people out there that have some thing in their life that could hold them back, okay? My son 
has muscular dystrophy and every day he gets weaker but did you know and I guess you wouldn't know this but every day he gets up every single day he gets up he gets out of bed and he gets on his computer and he works his gaming channel on YouTube every day he makes a video every day he engages his social media every day he pursues his dream every single day and he's my hero because if you guys see how weak he is muscular dystrophy is a horrendous d disease and I'm not telling anybody this to make anybody feel sorry for me I'm telling you this to encourage you my son is my hero he is he's so physically weak but he is spiritually and mentally and emotionally strong and he doesn't give up and you know what watching him fight watching him pursue his dream it sparked that in me and now I am pursuing my dream now I am working hard now I no longer feel sorry for myself I take that energy and I rechannel it now I'm not getting down on anybody who just can't do it I understand that there are limitations in every person's life but what I am trying to convey in this video is that nothing was handed to me I wasn't born with a silver spoon in my mouth I don't have some super duper rich man's job where I can just throw money away believe me I don't but I do make money with my synthesizers not just selling them but with projects and work for other people and licensing I do all of that stuff money that I make I work for and I work hard and I want you to understand this so that you don't give up on any of your dreams again I'm not getting down on anybody who has hit a bump in life and they're suffering right now I've been there I know what it's like to hurt believe me I know what it what it's like to lose everything and not have the energy to get up and to continue on and and here's something else everybody needs help along the way everybody and I know in my heart that God sent me my wife to support me to help me to stand by me I also know that know that he entrusted me with my son it's a hard life guys everybody's got one what are you gonna do with your life what are you gonna do with your synthesizers this isn't to beat anyone down please don't take this negatively I really want to encourage you guys today to understand that you're not alone in your struggles there's other people out there and you know what there's people that are worse off than me that are doing better than I am and I take my hat off to them I hope that this video has helped you in some way or another and if you haven't already done so hit that subscribe button because that helps me to be encouraged to continue doing these videos I'm pure ambient drone please leave a comment share your thoughts we've got some of the smartest people here on this channel contributing until next time cheers